A local sheriff says he's had a huge response to his offer of free weapons training for churches. Christian Hauser found out what's driving participants. Front Street Church of God here in Hamilton is one of the more than 100 churches to respond to the sheriff's offer for free security training. But it's something they never thought they would have to do. Deacon Paul McCarty has been with Front Street Church of God for about seven years. He watched the news about the deadly shooting in Texas last Sunday. It's heartbreaking. It's heartbreaking. You know, uh, people just want to come to church, just want to worship uh, and go back home, you want to come to church and just feel safe. McCarty's thankful for the sheriff's offer. He thinks all churches should have some type of security team. It is really sad that it's come to this, this day and age that uh, you just have to have somebody or someone or something just because you just never know. You just all want, always want to be prepared for uh, the what ifs that this happened or that, just want to be prepared. Sheriff Jones also saw the video of the armed parishioner shooting and killing the gunman. He knows even if someone had immediately called 911, it would have been several minutes or longer before law enforcement could get there. In 15 minutes, the police will get there. But in 15 minutes, a lot of people are going to die. In Texas, five to six seconds, the shooter was killed. So Jones is offering up free concealed carry and security training to any local church that wants it. It's not just churches, though. He'll help any religious group that asks. It's a sad time when you have to be prepared to take weapons in a place of worship, no matter what type of church or religious organization it is, and you can't go and pray and worship and have your beliefs. Jones tells me anytime he talks with religious leaders, he tells them they need to get a security plan in place. It's really sad that you have to go to this level, but you have no choice. In Hamilton, Christian Hauser, Local 12 News. And Sheriff Jones says the church has to agree to the training. It can't just be someone from a church. Ohio law says it's up to individual churches whether or not they want to allow guns in their buildings.